Hi everyone. For this lesson, I'll show you how to add and subtract polynomials. Remember, a polynomial is just an expression consisting of more than two terms. So for example, you can have something like this. 3x cubed plus 5x squared minus 7x plus 2. Okay, so this would be an example of a polynomial. So the first example is an example of a polynomial consisting of more than two terms. The second one here is a binomial because it has two terms. And the last one here is a monomial because it only has one. Okay, let's say you have these two polynomials. 15x squared plus 10x plus 2 and negative 11x squared plus 8x minus 8. And let's say we want to add them. Okay, so we want to add these two polynomials. Right? What you want to do is line them up. Right? We have the x squared with the x squared, the x with the x, and the number here with the other number. So let's add them up. So we have 15x squared minus 11x, or 15x squared plus a negative 11x squared. So that will give you 4x squared. Then we have 10x plus 8x, that will give you 18x. And plus 2 plus a negative 8, that will give us negative 6. So 15x squared plus 10x plus 2 plus negative 11x squared plus 8x minus 8 gives you a final answer here down below, which is 4x squared plus 18x minus 6. So that's an example of adding polynomials. Okay, we have two polynomials here. We have x to the fifth minus 2x cubed plus 3x squared minus 5x. And we have 3x to the fifth plus 5x cubed minus 2x squared plus 3x plus 15. And we are going to subtract this second polynomial from the first one. Okay? Alright, the first thing we want to do is distribute this negative sign here into each of the terms inside the second set of uh, parentheses here. Alright? So, now let's recopy the first polynomial over x to the fifth minus 2x to the third power plus 3x squared minus 5x. Okay, so now we have uh, negative 3x to the fifth after we distribute the negative sign into the 3x to the fifth. So let's try to line that, that up over here. So that will be negative 3x to the fifth. And then we have negative 5x cubed, negative 5x cubed, put it right underneath the x cubed. And then negative and a negative, so that becomes a positive, 2x squared. And then we have negative 3x, because we have a negative and a positive 3. Negative 3x, right underneath of negative 5x. And then we have negative uh, times the positive 15, which gives us negative 15. Okay, so let's draw the line. And now we can just combine them, right? So x to the fifth minus 3x to the fifth is negative 2x to the fifth. And then we have negative 2x cubed and negative 5x cubed, so that will be negative 7x cubed. And then we have a plus 3x squared plus 2x squared, that will give us 5x squared. And then we have a negative 5x minus 3x, so that will give us a negative 8x. And the last one, there's no number for the first polynomial, so we just have negative 15. We're just going to bring that down. All right? So notice we can't simplify anymore. Right? So this is our final answer here. Negative 2x to the fifth minus 7x cubed plus 5x squared minus 8x minus 15. Okay? And we're done and we're happy.